here in this replay is got uh, an ace game in the, the tier 6 uh, British light tank snake bite. So, uh, yeah, really like this tank. It's really, really fast. It's fairly small. Uh, yeah, it's just so much fun. Uh, the equipment I'm running on this is the, uh, the virtual vocal stabilizer, uh, the, the rammer, and the optics. So yeah, just, just line them up. I'm not taking any shots at the moment. Let's try and take a shot at this uh, Yak Panther. I'm missing quite a few of them. Doesn't seem as though uh, our, our team are in position to actually take any shots. I get spotted. Uh, this Tiger 217 turns to take a, a shot at me. Gun gets damaged, so I've already burnt the, uh, the repair kit, unfortunately. Yeah, just just coming up to this building, see if I can just play it a shot. Uh, artillery uh, I think spotted uh, my allies, so yeah, just take taking shots now. I've got a sort of a 50-50 split, uh, premium uh, and standard rounds. Uh, I know I should really uh, stock up have the majority of the shells as, as, the, as the premium rounds, but uh, I find that the, the standard shells are, are, are good sort of when you're fighting other land, light tanks or lightly armoured uh, tank destroyers. Uh, so yeah, it's, it's just, a, just a cost thing really. Uh, I don't like shooting premium rounds if I can help it, but with this one it does need it, but as I said, uh, I use the standard ones when I have fights. So just chasing this uh, as a free k down. I break off the chase uh, because I feel that if I follow him, I'm just going to get hit by everything in the back. So yeah, hesitate there. Uh, I think artillery. I'm not too sure if I was spotted or or the tiger p was spotted. Uh, not too sure with artillery who they're aiming at. Sometimes uh, he could have been aiming absolutely anywhere and it could have landed there. So yeah, not too too sure who was aiming at. So yeah, just got the cruise control on now. Uh, just just gonna sort of go back and back and throw uh, along this along this ridge to see if I can catch anyone out who overextends. I feel like we've kind of lost this uh, this centre portion of the map and, and sort of the one two line as well. Uh, just trying to to see if anyone makes a mistake. Uh, this light tank comes up, uh, so I'll just try and get a couple of shots into him. I miss all of them, but I've pushed him off. We seem to have lost the town as well. We've just got the, uh, the heavy in there. One of our heavies is going over. He's he's uh, seen it as well uh, that we're losing the town, and our, our friendly light tank has abandoned the one two line. So I'm, I'm thinking at this point, it's we're only down one tank, but we've lost control of the map, I feel. Uh, artillery's uh, taking shots at us, uh, which uh, optimistic <laughs> highly artillery, but I suppose uh, it sees me as the threat. Uh, yeah, he's probably expecting me to, to charge him at some point, but I'm not going to YOLO, I'm just going to stay on this side, see if anyone like this, uh, Leo, uh, comes up to just try and get some shots in. He takes a snapshot, just try and, uh, this is just R1, R2 at this point. As you can see the gun depression over the back is, is quite bad. Uh, other than that, uh, the, you know, you, you've got a good range of, of movement on, on the gun, so uh, it's just over the back really, you can't get it down sometimes when you, when you run away like that. So just going in on this Leo again, uh, again, got the cruise control on, no intention of actually stopping, put one in, go round, put another in, and finish it off. So I'm down to sort of five premium rounds, I've, I've left them in because I, I, I felt as though our team was going to collapse at any minute and I just wanted to get damage in. Uh, take a snapshot on this AMX 12T on the move. Miss both shots. Uh, he's lit, and there's a, a TD and a light up there, so uh, I'm going to leave uh, that light to, to them. Notice that he's charging across. Uh, I feel that 
At this point I'm thinking if our friendly light tank is AFK. Uh, the shell velocity is really slow on this I find. Uh, considering they're supposed to be APCR. Just putting some shots into the back of this VK01T. He's not moving. Uh, doesn't look like he's, the, the tracks are off. Uh, yeah. It looked like he tried to reverse out of, out of trouble, but uh, got, the, got the last shot. So we're two, down two tanks, uh, down one now, with, with that fire on the uh, T-34-100. I haven't really moved from this position. Uh, I've, I've played it quite uh, controlled. It is tempting, especially when that artillery was aiming at me, uh, just to charge over the top, see who I could light up. Uh, but as you saw at the start, no one was getting shots on the ones I was, I was lighting up and I feel like no one's in the position now. Our light tank at our base has, has finally moved so he is actually playing. Uh, yeah, just, just keeping this, uh, this tank destroyer lit. Uh, take a shot onto the side, just put one in, put a second in. Uh, I just want to move now. I uh, don't want to stay there. He takes a shot, misses. So now I'm just... Uh, that light tank is, is the last one. Uh, not too sure how useful it's going to be. He's looks like he's hiding in, in the little town, uh, village area in the sort of uh, northwest corner. So I'm thinking I'm going to try and have him as helpful as I, I can. Uh, seems to be wanting to go down the one line so I'm just trying to see if I can spot uh, for it. Uh, it seems to be charging so I'm thinking he's after artillery. Uh, I know the TDs are sort of in the middle of the map. Uh, so I'm just cautious because I'm looking at my camo circle as well and noticing that if they do appear sort of on this side of of that central ridge of, of houses that they will should be able to spot me. But we're still advancing, we haven't spotted on until now, we've just spotted this, this TD. I believe it's the same one from earlier, so I, I don't think he's got too much of a, a view range. A friendly light tanks a couple of uh, a couple of shots into him. Can't get a shot. Uh, hoping now, a friend, he may be on the reload. I get spotted, uh, and I'm just here though. I see the artillery. So I feel quite safe here that no one's got any shots on me. Just risking it for one last shot, and I'll get it in. So now I'm on the standard rounds. Uh, it's 3 2, so we've got rid of the artillery. I, I feel that I can, I can get rid of this one. The aiming circle is uh, yellow, uh, so I have I, no confidence going through that at all, so he spins around to uh, try and get a shot on me. My ally is able to, uh, able to shut him down. I'm going to ping to defend the flag, uh, get a reply from my teammate, which, which is uh, surprising, which is, which is always good to, to actually see. Uh, not too sure if he was just playing it super passive at the start. Uh, but yeah, just, just 32 seconds now on, on the, uh, the cap countdown. I'm just wondering which one of the two it is up there. <coughs> so it's both of them. Uh, so we've got this T-3485, I take a shot, bounce. So this is when I, I, I should have really had uh, the full premium. But we go through the front, it tracks me. We get hit, our driver goes down. Uh, at this point it doesn't look too good. Get a snapshot on the move and get another one on the move. Down to our last nine shells now. I have to admit, I wasn't paying attention, so if I knew that I was down to my last seven now, I don't think I would have been taking these shots. Uh, surprisingly, they're still trying to cap in this situation. I make a bit of a stupid play and end up hitting the side of the uh, map. Got two rounds left. At this point, I've now realised 
so I make sure the last two try and go into the sides. I'm out of ammunition now, so I'm just trying my best uh, keep my uh, auto lock on him just so he's targeted is is on so he knows someone's at least looking at him to keep him on his toes pinging uh, out of ammo our light tank as, as I said at the start he seems to be not too sure if he's having connection issues or anything because now he's gone he's just stopped now he's moving again uh, he's not acknowledged that I've lost uh, my out of ammo, uh, but now I'm just trying to, to keep the T34 lit and keeping myself hidden. He's doing the correct thing. He's against two light tanks. He's going towards the town, which which is which is a good play for him. Light tank goes is going along the A line, so I'm thinking I'm going to try and try and catch him by using the D line. I'm, just going through these buildings, I know he's over in that, that corner somewhere and I feel like he's just trying to be sort of hold down where some of the artillery goes sometimes. Come around this corner. Just go just really slow, so if I do spot him I can just put the brakes on. I'm trying to get the uh, light tank to move in as well. I'm out of ammo. The T-3485 must be thinking what I'm doing, we're not firing, but uh, he's now chasing me. Uh, just trying to get away now, just weaving, just weaving, go around here. feel like I can get away from him, but he tracks me. Then he comes in, comes in for the ram, puts me down to full health. Yeah, that's it. Yeah, not too sure what the uh, my friendly light tank was doing. He's now realised where the enemy is. Uh, he's down to a, a one shot now. The T thirty four eight five takes a shot, and uh, the T twenty one gets a gets the last shot into him. So yeah, we do win that. Uh, I'm just seeing the results screen now. So yeah, obviously a victory. Get the MVP. Uh, yeah, so really really good tank uh, it is really fast we get 38 direct hits in that one which is which is really good the ace tanker there uh, high caliber in a in a snake bite uh, a bit strange to see but uh, there it is yeah so just uh, just over 3100 damage and, and just under uh, 1500 assisted so yeah really good tank definitely worth picking up uh, if you don't like light tanks, uh, probably that's the only reason I would say don't get it if you don't like light tanks. Uh, it is sort of a light tank in the extreme, very fast, uh, very mobile, but the armour won't hold up, the gun lacks the penetration. Uh, it's quick firing as you, as you saw, run out of ammo, uh, but, but yeah, I definitely recommend getting it, if it's, especially if it's on sort of weekly or personal offer, so yeah. Uh, hopefully you enjoyed that that replay, uh, and, and thanks for watching.